this event was very, very improbable to happen if uh, climate change didn't, wasn't with us. In late June, British Columbia was trapped in a heat dome, with many parts of the province seeing extreme record-breaking temperatures. Now a new report shows that June's heat wave was the deadliest weather event in Canadian history. This was the most deadly weather event in Canadian history, probably by a factor of about three. At a conference of the Union of BC Municipalities on Wednesday, Dr. Sarah Henderson with the BC Centre for Disease Control described the severity of the heat dome in June. We speak about this as a one in 1,000 year event. It hopefully gives you a picture of how extreme this event was. We had temperatures from the 27th to the 29th that had simply never been recorded before across many, many parts of the province. On June 29th, Vancouver hit its highest ever recorded temperature of 32.4 degrees Celsius, which exceeds the average temperature on that day for the last four years by nearly 12 degrees. Further inland, Abbotsford hit 42.9 degrees on June 28th, and in the interior of BC, Canada's hotspot of Lytton hit 48.6 degrees on June 29th. The next day, Lytton burned to the ground. Meanwhile, heat-related deaths were skyrocketing in the province. Provincially, over this one week period, the hottest one week, there was about a 100% increase in provincial mortality. Out of uh, uh, people's memory, I don't think they've seen anything uh, like this. And that shows, um, and it's also showed by the fact that so many people uh, died because if we expected these events, then we would have been more prepared. But the warnings were out there. Early on, some meteorologists were calling it a heat wave of concern or even one of the worst heat waves in history. Ambulance dispatchers and paramedics described the heat wave emergency response as a complete system collapse. We clearly have to be better prepared to in, in, invite the public to common places. Again, during a global pandemic, difficult to do, to find uh, cooling centers, uh, hiring more uh, uh, paramedics, hiring more uh, uh, frontline workers to address these challenges. In Vancouver, Kirjunos, City News.